What's up, everyone? Happy Monday. It's thank God it's Monday edition. Uh, everyone likes to say thank God it's Friday, but we need to be thankful for every day that God gives us when we wake up on the right side of the grass. So this afternoon, we are back here at Hempstead Lake State Park. Love this place. Really cool spot to hang out. Really peaceful. Little slice of heaven right here. A couple miles outside of New York City. That's where you're upstate. New York. Really pretty. Actually, I just found out that my buddy Keith Corbett, mayor of Malvern, running for Congress, uh, was involved in uh, the improvements that are happening here at this lake. So, uh, fun fact of the day. Good, good stuff. Uh, thanks, Keith, because this place is awesome. They're doing a lot of nice work here. So, here we are at the lake, getting you the message of the day. So, uh, we crossed the 300 day mark on the We Ride at Dawn, and we're coming into the home stretch here. And we gotta keep the messages going. I thought I was out of this cold weather, but uh, uh, guy thinks it's funny to mess with me, I guess. So 23 degrees this morning. So I decided to do the afternoon ride instead of the morning ride because uh, 23 degrees is just brutal on the bike. I'm not up for that anymore. I did, a couple, did it a couple of times over the winter and uh, it's just numbing. So, uh, so we're doing the afternoon ride today. Sun is shining, it's a beautiful day. And um, today we're going to talk about, uh, I did my buddy Michael Potorti's uh, podcast, uh, Crushing Your Fear, and it uh, just dropped, and we had a great conversation, I actually almost forgot about it, it was, uh, let's see, I think it was like a day 160 when I was there, so we were 120 days ago or so we did that, and uh, great conversation about fear. keeps us from doing what we want to do and what we need to do um, and a lot of it is just in our heads for no reason um, fear uh, false evidence appearing real that's what fear stands for false evidence appearing real so we have these fake ideas in our head that something bad is going to happen that something's not going to go right so we get scared of it and we stay away from it and we need to embrace these fears and realize that it is false evidence and we need to charge ahead and we need to um, have confidence in ourselves and stand on our two on on our own two feet and spread our wings and fly uh, we can't be scared we can't have fear um, fear of the unknown there's just a good much chance of something going right as there is of going wrong you got a 50 50 shot that something's going to work out you got a 50 50 shot that's not going to work out we got to look at the glass is half full we got to look with the faith that it's going to work Faith, hope, and love was a message the other day. We need to have the faith that what we're working on is going to work out. That journey we're going to take is going to work out. That career we're going to take is going to work out. That relationship we're going to take is going to work out. And we got to stop looking at the false ev evidence and looking at it as real. It's not real. It's made up in your head. Think about all the things you've been afraid of in your life that really were no big deal. I'd say 99% of the things that you were at fear over in your life were really no big deal and made up in your head. When you finally tackled the situation I needed to tackle, it was really no big deal. It was all made up in your head. Just think about that. What are you afraid of? Why are you afraid of it? And why is it stopping you? And how are you going to get past that? So there's your message of the day. Let's jump on prayers over here. It's a beautiful day to say a prayer over here on the lake. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to get past our fears. Help us to realize that fear is just false evidence appearing real. Help us to have faith in you and know that uh, you have our path paved out for us and that uh, every difficulty that goes in front of us is there to make us stronger and to not be afraid and to have confidence and go forward with faith. Amen. All right, so there's your message today. Don't be afraid. Fight your fear. False evidence appearing, appearing real. Uh, it's really what it is. Things that you have to, been afraid of in your life that you've had fear over really were a bunch of nonsense in the end. So here we are, Hempstead Lake State Park. This is uh, one of the trails here going up next to the lake. Beautiful spot. That's the Southern State Parkway up there. Everyone there is sitting in traffic while I'm sitting here on the lake. 
a beautiful thing. So if you haven't checked out Hempstead Lake State Park yet, check it out. Like I said, I just found out that uh, my buddy Keith Corbett running for Congress, uh, Malvern Mayor, was involved in uh, some of the uh, funding for this project over here. And it's actually a really amazing job they're doing. So if you haven't been here, come down and check it out. It's beautiful. They're cleaning up all the paths. They're cleaning up all the trees. They uh, made a science center here, an environmental center. They made a kayak launch and a uh, fishing pier and a lookout tower, all good stuff. So come check it out. All right, everyone. Have a great Monday, Monday fun day. Tonight uh, on the Fire Starts Fire live podcast, with any luck, I'm going to have a friend of mine, Donna, uh, who is a counselor. I want her to come on and talk about um, all the grief, uh, all the all the um, depression, all the stuff that's going on bad in the world since COVID and since this new normal that we found. Um, she's dealing with a lot of stuff, and uh, I thought maybe uh, she can give some insight to stuff that we're dealing with, to uh, that our friends are dealing with, that our family are dealing with, and uh, maybe she can offer you some insight. So she's doing her best to get on tonight. I have like a 95% confirmation, but she does have some situation she's dealing with, so she said she might not. That'll be up in the air. So anyway, I'll have someone on. Tonight, 8.30 p.m., live here on Facebook. Check it out. Get some fire live. All right, everyone. God bless. See you tonight.